what is going on guys and welcome back to the channel once again so today we got a couple things um i finally got her tinted so that's a huge huge mod plus uh whatever you want to call it but uh that was really needed because this thing was a fishbowl and the heat was just crazy right now but now we're good something legal all the way around and the brow so that's one of the things that we did today and another thing that we're gonna do today is the suspension so let me get home real quick and I'm gonna show you all the little setup we got I'm, I'm really excited I've always wanted this and um, but yeah I'm finally we're gonna have the opportunity to to run this kind of setup it's not it's nothing crazy it's nothing crazy at all but it's something that I've always wanted like I've said and, and yeah just it's a nice start it's a nice start for sure for the off-road build so so yeah let me get home real quick and I'll show you all so yeah catch you all right guys so we're finally home and as you can see we have a lot of boxes I have a lot of boxes and these are the these are the struts I got the coilovers so I'm really excited for these these are Fox 2.5s with the reservoir um, I think these are the just non adjustables or well you can actually adjust them but I think the other ones are called dual dual adjustable uh, I'm not I'm not really sure to be honest but these are eight, Fox 2.5s gives me a two inch level in the front so that's what we want to fit my setup and i actually do have the wheel setup ready but i'm not going to show you all to the next video but yeah these are it these are pretty nice oh we wanted these and here they are so yeah i'm gonna start getting to it um i think my brother also has a little bit of projects right here I think he's putting a third brake light. He's putting a third brake light. Little, just a little detail, you know. The antenna, little bullet antenna. But yeah, um, let me go eat real quick. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm not supposed to see that right there. But some, some lighting for the truck as well. But yeah, let me go eat real quick, and then we're gonna go ahead and install these. I am not gonna make a full how-to video i really want this just to be a little smoother kind of type of video just showing y'all uh here and there little pieces of the of the process but but yeah that's pretty much it's pretty much it for right now and yeah i'll catch you in a little bit all right guys so we're finally gonna install the the coilovers today so so let's get to it i also got a few other things you can see over there which is going to be on a separate video as well but let's go ahead and start this madness of tearing her apart and yeah so see how it goes guys <sighs> all right guys wheels off so keep on let's keep on going all right guys so this is where we're at don't worry none of this is really um, tight all these lines right here you just have to unbolt it from your from your knuckle or spindle whatever you want to call it uh, get these little clips off off of there bolts 10 millimeter bolts one eight millimeter bolt oh, shit. bunch of clips um, I disconnected this from the top I don't know if you can see, but there's a connector right there somewhere. 
I disconnected it, just brought it down because this will get pulled if you don't disconnect it. So there's that. Um, obviously, you get your nut off the axle shaft. So I don't know where it's at right now. I don't know why there's a bag right there either. Um, right there. Um, and that's it. It should slide out. It should slide out. Get this off as well. Um, 13 16 Alright guys, so I'm gonna start start taking these off with the crash bars. This is not necessary for this particular um, install on the coilovers, but since I'm gonna be running some big tires, um, I might as well do it now. So I'm gonna remove the front and the rear crash bars just to play it safe, and I really don't wanna have problems with the big tires. So that's why. But yeah, guys, this is the progress. Sort of the same, but we're just gonna remove the crash bars and put everything back together on this side, and we should be good. So yeah. All right, guys, she's finally done. I know I skipped through a lot, but I had warned y'all that I really um, didn't want to make this video super long just because I don't have that much time here. Um. Yeah, I have to go back to my my new house, so but yeah, this is it. So this is the two inch level fox coilover with the reservoir. Um I haven't test drove it yet, but um I also did the crash bar modifications on both sides. Right there and right there. And this does look like it lifted it up. Plenty to fit those 35s, but we'll see. We'll see what kind of problems we run into. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for right now. I'm gonna go test driver, and I'll get back with y'all. But yeah, guys, that's that's pretty much it for today's video. Just want to thank y'all for watching, and appreciate the support, guys. And there's gonna be plenty more. So um, that's it for today's video. Uh, thank y'all for watching. Catch you on the next one.